Kishwar himself ahead of the grilling session uh, that is scheduled to take place any time uh, any time from now. Yesha, my colleague, continues to stay with us. Yesha, apart from the office or उनके अधिकारियों ने मांगे वो सब लेके जा रहा हूँ. उसके साथ वो जो भी पूछेंगे उसको मैं उत्तर दूँगा. और जो भी सपोर्ट करना है वो सपोर्ट मैं वहाँ पे करूँगा अगर अगर आप अगर आप ईडी के अधिकारी के बारे में बोले तो वो उनका काम कर रहे हैं उनके खिलाफ मेरा कुछ भी नहीं है मैं तो हर वक्त उनको सपोर्ट करने के लिए सपोर्ट करने के लिए सोचता हूँ और अभी सपोर्ट भी करूँगा अगर जो हमारे विरोध में जो लोग हैं पॉलिटिकली उनका अगर कहना है कि इस बंदे पे प्रेशर डाला जा सकता है तो शायद वो भूल गए मैं मराठी मानूस हूँ मैं डरता नहीं और अगर प्रेशर डालने के लिए ये सब कुछ हुआ है तो एक गलत बंदे पे उन्होंने ये एक्सपेरिमेंट किया ऐसे मुझे बोलना पड़ा सवाल ये है कि कहीं कही ना कहीं ना कहीं जब तक अरेस्ट भी कर लेते हैं ईडी का संजय राउत या नवाब मलिक के बारे में देखो ऐसे लोगों को लग रहा है कि वहाँ पे शायद अरेस्ट भी हो सके मैंने गलत तो कुछ किया नहीं मैं जो भी डॉक्यूमेंट वो मांगेंगे वो देने वाला हूँ तो अरेस्ट का प्रश्न आता नहीं लेकिन अगर जो भी वो उनके प्रोसीजर के हिसाब से करेंगे फिर हमको न्याय व्यवस्था जो है कोर्ट उसके माध्यम से रिलीफ लेना पड़ेगा लेकिन लड़ना तो पड़ेगा All right, so that was Rohit Pawar ahead of the questioning. Uh, Yesha, my colleague, continues to stay with us live from the NCP office. Uh, Yesha, big statement that uh, Rohit Pawar just now made that he's a Marathi manus, so that uh, so he cannot be scared by the uh, investigative agencies. And uh, uh, is arrest also likely today? Uh, so as of now, we cannot really comment on whether his arrest is likely. This is in fact the first summon that has been issued to Rohit Pawar in this case. Earlier, as we speak of, uh, there was there was this EOW case and ED case wherein ED had conducted raids at various locations related to uh, related to Rohit Pawar's uh, residence as well as his offices, where all the evidences and documents have been gathered. However, now whether uh, uh, what how will the investigation pan out depends on uh, once he reaches and how he cooperates with the investigation. Uh, of course, considering the fact that it is his first summons and he is being present at the enforcement directorate for his first summons, ED will uh, sit. Uh, ED will sit with him. They will gather all these evidence. They will question him. Questioning would be around the fact uh, that how Kanad SSK was taken over by Baramati Agro. What were the funds uh, that? Uh, what was the funds that the Baramati Agro uh, got from MSCB Bank and from the other entities? Uh, so on the basis of all of this, uh, once all of these uh, recordings, uh, once all of these statements are recorded, once all of these evidences are gathered, it depends on all of that and how all of that pans out is uh, where uh, uh, the further course of action by enforcement directorate would be determined. Uh, it is uh, in fact around 11, so in an hour from now is where we will see Rohit Pawar uh, reaching the enforcement directorate office. And uh, once he reaches the enforcement directorate office, is uh, where uh, what happens next is uh, the fact that his questioning takes place all until his questioning is on. Shahid Pawar has said that he'll be sitting at this very NCP office, and once uh, considering Rohit Pawar has left from his residence, he'll be reaching here in the next uh, say 20 minutes to 30 minutes. Is where we'll see uh, he uh, for the uh, once he reaches approximately for next 20 to 30 minutes, uh, he'll be flanked by all of these uh, uh, supporters of uh, NCP along with Supriya Sule who would be heading. Uh, To the enforcement directorate office, but uh, if you uh, if you speak of the tight police bandobas right here at both the ends of N NCP office, uh, at the extreme end on the left and right there is there is tight police bandobas. So uh, apart from that, considering that this lane uh, approximately say two lanes away from this very uh, location is where the enforcement directorate office is. Uh, there is uh, there is tight police bandobas. And uh, also, there uh, also there are barricades right. that have been yes, put in place. Yes, sir. Please stay with us. Vehicle. We're now being joined by NCP uh, spokesperson Clyde Cra uh, Castro on the broadcast. Uh, sir, a very good morning to you. So, uh, Ra uh, Rahul Pawar, Rohit Pawar is going to be uh, interrogated by the investigative uh, agency today, and uh, he claims that he has done nothing wrong, and so there's nothing to be scared of. Your reaction? Well, there's absolutely nothing about. Uh, the ED has called him today. He is going to go there. He is going to cooperate with them. Whatever questions are asked, whatever documents required will be presented to the ED, and this is what it's going to be. So, but if you like, Yesha was saying just now. Uh, you know, you see the way things are panning out here. We are all here in support of him. I am also here in the office, but the police is barricading us. 
point here is very simple he is willing to cooperate he is not going to say no to anything but you see what is happening around in the state also there are a lot of leaders from the bjp themselves who were questioned by uh, people from the bjp before they joined them now those people are with the bjp no questions are being asked their cases are closed their files are closed and here is a person who is willing to cooperate and questions are being raised on him so somewhere the people are going to realize what this is and why this is happening but mr krasno we have seen such things happening in the past as well uh, it happened with nawab malik also he also claimed that he has done nothing wrong and uh, uh, that he has no role to play in the scam but uh, we saw uh, that he was uh, arrested at the end yeah but he was arrested but nothing yet yet has been proved right nothing has come out of it he is out on bail right now nothing has been proved that's what i'm trying to say the process is the punishment so if you do not have anything on anybody there's a right to bail there's a right to uh, uh, you know present the case but like having said that let them ask questions we will cooperate and we'll bring out the truth in front of the people of maharashtra and india what will be the ncp's uh, further strategy the strategy right now is to see we have to wait see at the end of the day it's a central agency the central agency is asking certain questions we will cooperate we will present whatever has to be presented but we will keep fighting the point here is we will keep fighting against this whole system that has been laid out by the bjp what is wrong we will always highlight it and the role of the opposition in the democracy is to show the mirror to the incumbent government and that's what we are going to do all right mr krasno thank you so mu- so much for speaking to cnn news 18 and for your views yesha coming back to you uh, apart from sharad pawar and supriya sule who are the senior leaders who are uh, currently present at the ncp office Uh, so yes uh, taking in from there uh, we have sharad pawar and supriya sulu are present they like class was spoken but of course what's important to note is that there are several other senior leaders including uh, jain patel for that matter jitin dawa they have not really come here uh, something that you'd also remarked about how there were similar scenes of protests uh, that had taken place right here uh, when uh, for that matter nawab malik was being questioned by enforcement directorate or even jain patel when he was summoned here we'd seen very similar scenes uh, at uh, this ncp office uh, when there were summons issued to them and today Uh, while we see there are summons issued to uh, to uh, rohit pawar there are similar scenes right here uh, sir bataiye ki uh, jab hum baat kare iske pehle jain patel ko summon kiya gaya tha aaj jain patel lekin yahan pe aaye nahi hain uh, nahi hum dekhe ki uh, jitendra awa jo hamesha quite vocal rehte hain ye sab cheezon pe wo bhi aaj present nahi hain to sir us pe uh, kya kehna hai abhi tak khali subah ke 10 baje hai to abhi tak sab aana chalu hai अभी तक खाली साहब आए ताई आया दादा आ रहे बाकी सब लोग भी आ रहे और काफी ट्रैफिक है और काफी ये लोग ने सब पुलिस बंदोबस्त बढ़ाया है तो बहुत हमारे सब कार्यकर्ता लोग है जो सब युवा लोग है जिनका मतलब खाली रोहित दादा का जो संघर्ष है जिन्होंने देखा है और जो रोहित दादा को सपोर्ट करने आ रहे हैं वो लोग को भी पब्लिक रुका रही है मतलब पब्लिक को सब पुलिस वाले रुका रहे इसके लिए अभी तक कोई पहुंच नहीं पा रहा है और आप देख सकते हो तो ये सब जगह रोड का काम चालू है तो सिंगल लेन चला है तो इसके लिए ट्रैफिक पूरा हो गया तो जैसा ऐसा टाइम थोड़ा लेट हो लेकिन सब जन आ जाएंगे सर uh, हम जहाँ बात करें कि ऐसी सब सेम परिस्थिति है सेम सीन हमने देखा था जब इसके पहले नवाब मलिक को बुलाया गया था ईडी ऑफिस पे जैन पाटिल को बुलाया तभी भी आ, लोग आ, जमा हुए थे तो आज फिर से जमा होने का क्या रीजन है नहीं नहीं ये तो रोहित दादा को जो नोटिस आया उसके कारण जो रोहित दादा ने जो युवा संघर्ष यात्रा निकला था जो युवकों का जो प्रश्न लेके वो 800 किलोमीटर का जो उन्होंने पैदल चल के जो बीजेपी एम एल अतुल भटकालकर इज नाउ ज्वाइनिंग अस ऑन द ब्रॉडकास्ट मिस्टर भटकालकर रोहित पवार बिफोर गोइंग टू द ईडी सेज दैट ही हैज ही हैज मिस्टर भटकारकर रोहित पवार की ईडी क्वेश्चनिंग से पहले उन्होंने स्टेटमेंट दिया है कि वो एक मराठी मानुस है इसलिए वो किसी भी तरह के दबाव से डरेंगे नहीं और उनका ये भी कहना है कि उनका कोई रोल नहीं है इस पूरे स्कैम में आपका आपका क्या कहना होगा इस पे नहीं इसमें मराठी मानुस भी उसका कोई संबंध नहीं है ये रोहित पवार की नौटंकी चल रही है वो सीधा ईडी को सामने जाए उनके खिलाफ जो केस है वो आज की नई केस नहीं है ये दो बरस से इसका इन्वेस्टिगेशन चालू है उन्होंने जो शुगर फैक्ट्री जिसकी कीमत 500 करोड़ से भी ज्यादा थी वो 50 करोड़ में दूसरे के नाम से कैसी परचेस की उसका जवाब उन्होंने देना चाहिए मनी लॉन्ड्रिंग हुआ कि नहीं मनी लॉन्ड्रिंग किसने किया ये सब बातों का जवाब उन्होंने उन्होंने देने की आवश्यकता है और वो ईडी के सामने ये सभी जवाब उन्होंने देने चाहिए 
ये नौटंकी तुरंत बंद करनी चाहिए ऐसी नौटंकी करके तपास यंत्रणा के ऊपर कोई भी किसी भी प्रकार का दबाव नहीं आ सकता है और इसके लिए जो कानून में है वो कानून से कार्रवाई रोहित पवार के खिलाफ होगी जी आ... आप हमारे साथ बने रहिए वी आर ऑल्सो बीन ज्वाइन बाय कांग्रेस पार्टीज चरण सिंह सापरा ऑन द ब्रॉडकास्ट मिस्टर सापरा वेरी गुड मॉर्निंग टू यू सो वी जस्ट हर्ड बीजेपी एम एल ए अतुल भटकालकर अटैकिंग द एन सी पी कॉलिंग ऑल दिस नॉटन की द शो ऑफ स्ट्रेंथ दैट इज करेंटली अंडर वे एंड ऑल्सो द स्टेटमेंट दैट वॉज कमिंग इन फ्रॉम रोहित पवार हिमसेल्फ ही क्लेम्स दैट देर इज अ मनी लॉन्ड्रिंग दैट हैज बीन डन बाय द बाय रोहित पवार एंड ही बॉट अ फैक्ट्री वर्थ फाइव हंड्रेड क्रो एट अ प्राइज ऑफ फिफ्टी क्रो See, I feel this is a clear case of uh, political vendetta, and we have been seeing this uh, since last ten years. And only the opposition leaders are being targeted. Um, I would like to ask the BJP spokesperson when uh, we are talking about money laundering. There are there are many money laundering cases on uh, leaders who are in government now, uh, like Mr. Praful Patel, uh, Mr. Pratap Sarnaik, Yamini Jadhav, uh, Bhavna Gavli. uh hasan mushrif who is a minister also so why those cases are not being persuaded unko kyu piche choda ja raha hai just because isliye ki wo washing machine mein dhul gaye hain bjp ke sath mein aaye hain to washing machine mein dhul gaye hain wo log aur kamal detergent se saaf kar diya gaya unko so this is a clear case of political vendetta character assassination and this is a ploy of narendra modi or bjp government that all the opposition leaders character assassination should be done ed uh, it or uh, the cbi they are the frontal organization of bhartiya janata party all right mr sapra please stay with us uh, atul bhatkarkar ji uh, mr sapra ka ye kehna hai ki kai aise neta bjp mein maujood hai jinke khilaf jinke upar money laundering ke aarop hai unke uh, unke against koi action kyun nahi liya jata hai kabhi ये सपरा ही को ऐसा लग रहा है तो वो कोर्ट में क्यों नहीं जा रहे वो पीएल क्यों नहीं दाखिल कर रहे कि इसकी इंक्वायरी एक्सपीडिएट करो करके आई एम गिविंग ओपन चैलेंज टू हिम गो टू दो टू दो हाईकोर्ट फाइल द पी एल आज फॉर द एक्सपीडिशन ऑफ दल सो कॉल्ड केसेस सो दे शुड एंसर द बेसिक क्वेश्चन वेदर मनी लॉन्ड्रिंग हैज टेकन प्लेस in rohit pawar's case is not that is a moot answer moot question instead of giving answer to the moot question they are saying that the case is going on against them somebody else and case is going on nobody nobody's case has been withdrawn by id and if they want if they want they can go to the court they can ask for the expedition of their, their cases no issue about that nobody is taking objection on that all right mr bhatkalkar and uh, mr charan singh sapra thank you so much for speaking to cnn news 18 and uh, right now and uh, rohit pawar is speaking let's uh, listen in to him rajesh sir so these are the live visuals that are coming in from the ncp office ahead of the questioning of rohit pawar uh, by the ed lene wale hum cooperate iske aage bhi pehle bhi kiya hai aaj bhi kiya karenge aur kal bhi karenge rohit aapne bola ki aap marathi manus se darne wale mein se nahi hai jo samarthan hai definitely marathi manus kisse darta hai koi nahi darta hum marathi manus se hum nahi darte जो भी सपोर्ट चाहिए हमने गलती नहीं किया हम क्यों डरेंगे हम इन्फॉर्मेशन का तो असल लोक मत है अधिकार सहकार्य करते करना है Rohit Pawar ahead of the questioning by ED in uh, in MSCB case